there's a yeah a real nanny so, state yeah. thing going on um except the nanny doesn't want you to grow up it wants you to be a child forever Um, the rally was awesome in Sydney. It was a, such a surprise to see like 15,000 people out on the streets at once who all sort of shared the same opinion, which I haven't ever actually seen in Sydney. I think there was one guy who said, oh, thanks, thanks a lot, Mike Baird. Now we have to listen to Art vs. Science. Oh, uh, really? Uh, That's pretty cool. It's, it's the, when you're out at night, and you have the freedom to make art and to express yourself and to do it and to have a thriving culture, which is the daytime and nighttime culture. That's kind of where new thoughts can be generated and people can get together and actually talk about bigger things. Now, Raul, the back room, and sort of yeah, shut him place down. place where I met my girlfriend, who I live with. Like, that, that place is gone. Like, my friends ran that place and owned it and like, took care of it. And, all just all these places that we've met friends and like places so we played, played bands two play. places we played our actual first three gigs is out for science they're gone yeah there is a way to solve the violence problem but shutting down the entire city is not it we're at school at some point like someone had I can't remember what it was like someone had just taken something from someone like it doesn't really matter what it was someone had done something wrong and they got the whole school and they were like all right no one's leaving until the person comes forward I wish I like, had the guts to be like, well, I'm not staying here, I didn't do it, I'm out. Like, people go along with stuff so much of the time thinking, like, well, that's how it is and that's just the law. It's like, no. Like, through mass civil disobedience, you can have things change. Protests, you just stand up and say, like, no, this isn't good enough and if you're not going to change laws, we're going to get together and force you to. Just because laws exist doesn't mean you have to go along with them. If enough people say, like, that's stupid, let's all get together and show how stupid we think it is. Then that's how laws are changed. That's how revolutions start. People get together and go, this is bullshit. We're not going to put up with this anymore. Let's change this together. Peacefully. Always peacefully. <laughs>